Hi guys, and welcome back to some more Alice Mare. It is really hot in this room and I had to turn off my fan to record, so let's begin. Welcome back. I say with quite a smile, but you seem uncomfortable with the face you're making. Ah oh, well, at least you seem to have safely recovered the key. A job well done. Well then, I'll collect all the things from that world, and I'll put together those pages. Here you are. Obtained a vermilion notebook. Now then, I'll open the door to the next world. I'm counting on you once more. Is there a thing down there? No, okay. Right, next world, here we go. Hey there. Yo, Alice, nice weather, huh? You know what this calls for? You know? Yeah, 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 let's play. Go in, mouse cursor. Whoa, yeah, sweet, all right. Open up that closet. Your hand trembles. Hmm. Well, this looks nice. Yankee Doodle. Yankee Doodle came to town upon a Kentish pony, stuck a feather in his hat and called him Macaroni. Lovely. Beautiful. Okay. What's this? One is red, but all the others are black. Only one is red. The back of one is six. The back of three is four. The back of two is... The letters have been smudged out. I have no idea. Whoa! Okay. Hello? Hello? Don't know what that is. It's locked. Okay. For some reason, you can't proceed any further. Okay. It's locked. Before I talk to Creepy Face there, pick up a shard of triple X or quadruple X. He looks super tough. Back, back, front, behind, forward, forward, which? One, four, six, two, back, back, back. Back, don't know, back. Okay. I don't know what's happening. It's something to do with this. Is it things on the table? Only one, one is red, but all the others are black. Okay, so the chest, okay? One is red, but all the others are black, though. <sighs> so, after some time, um, I have absolutely no idea what to do. So, I cheated. Um, I, 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 I have no idea how you reach this conclusion, or even how the puzzle works, if I'm honest with you. But, uh... That's the answer. Back, back! One, four, six, two, six, three, one, five. Give this! Obtain a notebook scrap. The moon fell. The great big round moon fell. When I told mother, she looked surprised. There's a smile slightly. The moon hadn't really fallen. It still looked down on us from the sky. But I liked the face mother made, so I told her all sorts of things. I saw a big lizard talk. I saw the old man next door fly. I saw a cat swimming in the lake. Every time I said something, mother would be very surprised and laugh a lot. But she gradually stopped laughing. After that, Mother stopped looking at me. Okay, that's weird. Well, something's unlocked. Presumably this door here. Oh, hi. Huh? Hi, Alan. Jeez, you made me jump. No, nothing's locked. All the doors are wide open. Teacher? Nah, I don't know. I want to ask if this is a dream, but... Might be right. It looks like my house, but it's way smaller. Yeah, I've been having the same dream a bunch lately. But nobody's around, so I just sit here alone. But good to see you here, Alan. Let's go somewhere. Who knows, maybe we'll find somebody else. What's with that look? Uh, sorry. I'll follow Alan. Anyway's fine by me. Thanks. Wanna play? Takes like five hours, though. It's a board game, I guess. Probably Monopoly. Monopoly ends lives. The competitive nature of Monopoly, guys. Okay, I guess we can go up here now, maybe? With, uh... What's up? What, can't you go up here? You can't climb stairs, Alan. What's with that look? It was a joke. It's the same floor. No, this is different. Okay. There's teacher. I don't want to talk to him just yet. Let's have a look around first. 
Shouldn't open this. Okay. Yeah, lots of things going on right now. Lots of places to go. Want to play? <laughs> I don't know. Bar, bar, kilo, bar, deci, bar. Bar, bar, kilo, bar, deci, bar. Okay. Good for you. There's a little bit of space on the shelf. Okay. It's locked. It's empty. It's packed with books. Okay, we need to go and talk to teacher, I think. Unfortunately. Still think teacher is a bit weird. What's this here? You can't read it. I was born here, you know. Actually, I forgot where it was, but I guess this is the language there. People in different countries have different hair, eyes, even food. It's pretty cool. Teacher's eyes are all black. I wonder where he was born. I mean, yeah. Oh, that's all the same thing. Can't move that out of the way. There's a creepy curtain there. I have something behind it. Anyway, teacher, how you doing? Is it teacher? Huh, teacher's here. Huh? Alan and Joshua, huh? I guess I keep telling you. But would you stop hitting me on the hips so forcefully? Yeah, well, you never notice if I don't do that, teacher. Oof. Jesus, Joshua, calm down. Uh-huh, not on the flanks either. Anyway, why are you here? I mean, I guess anything can happen in a dream. It's not quite a dream. Personally, I'm surprised by the fact that Alan is here. <clears throat> you stay here. Don't even move, if possible. Don't go any further than this. I'll be leaving soon, so be careful. Huh? What's the scrap of paper? It was in teacher's pocket. What's that look? Teacher was like half asleep. It's fine, I'm t I tell you. Plus I swapped it with a toy spider. You want this? Boy, you're weird. Here. One day I said that father had gone cold while he slept. Mother was more surprised than she had ever been in a long time. Very surprised, so father died. Then she got angry, but I didn't stop. Almost daily I said that father had gone cold. She was very surprised every time, and got angry every time. I liked it, because she only, only talked with me when she was surprised. Okay, that's creepy. Man, what the heck? If it's not a dream, then what is it? I never got the stuff teachers going on about. Uh -huh. Maybe I'm just an idiot, you say. Alan! He's mad at this because we called him an idiot. You can't read it. Hard to read books, hard to read books. Oh, it takes fucked off, dude. That was weird. And the whole game's weird, but... Some creepy stories going on as well. Okay. Don't open that. And nothing. Sorry to startle you. What? This is so weird. Can't go eating this with our hands. The cream will get all sticky and it'll ruin our clothes. I'm not sure that's a good reason to not eat the cake, to be honest with you. This is so weird. I don't know where to go. What? Huh? Weird, it was open before. Why did it close? Hmm, hmm. I don't like thinking. Alan, you take the lead. Let us out. Ba ba kilo ba. Kim dum dum um ba ba. Says to tell I'm the letter that fits in the question mark. Hmm. Now I can't understand him just fine. Now I can understand him just fine. Anyway, all on you. Bar bar kilo bar, K H D M D. Um, bar bar. Guess. Um, that's the only Desi. Bar bar could be A or C. Bar. Says you're right. Why is it C? Oh, I see. Length. Knew you were smart, Alan. I have no idea. It, I did that because it was part of Desi. Oh, it unlocked this. The lock is open. Obtained a grabby arm. Man, I remember this thing. I used to use this to drop snake skins and stuff from above. Okay, there's nothing I can do with the shelf here as far as I can tell. No, I don't. Oh, you can pick up the cake now? 
A cake. Pick up the cake with a bar. Fuck. What? What do I do? It's firmly attached. Something stuffed under the bed. Use grabby arm. Use the grabby arm. Obtain a blue book. That goes on the shelf, I guess. Place blue book. It fit per it fits perfectly. And voila, we can escape the room. Of no we can't. Huh. You know what I mean? There are things a man's gotta have. Oh that's his bed, I guess. It's hanging a little this. Might come off. Remove painting. There are two small forks behind it. Hey, we can eat cake with these. Take one. Obtained a small fork. Eat the cake. Did I just die? You felt dizzy. There's a scrap in your pocket. Obtain a notebook scrap. I was locked in my room. I mean, I had a TV and I had toys, but it was different. Of course it was, right? They'd look at my sister and brother, but not at me. To be fair, you did rub it in the face that the father had died, or said he kept saying he was dead anyway. If only spiders and frogs could talk, I wouldn't be so bored. Yeah, I was different. Why? I mean, this is fucking weird. Wait. I'm gonna go pick up this, guys. Got a shard of triple X. Oh, yeah. Okay, so there's three eyes and a hole in the wall here. And in here. Okay. All the same room? Well, not all the same, but... What's that? What's a little box there? Excuse me, guys, hang on. No, it's just a bit of the furniture. I guess we'll go in. Okay, so a right-facing eye. Give me a light. It's a puzzle of some kind. A forward-facing eye. So forward and then right. So, and they were red and yellow. Okay, let's write this down, actually. Uh, forward, right. Red and yellow. Okay. Look in here. I think it's important to write this down because it probably is important. Look inside. That seems to be facing forward too. And it's like blue or green. And that's left. That. Okay. It's a left facing eye. Oh, is there something on the wall there? Yeah, there's, there's this. Hang on. Out the way, eyed monsters. You can't read it. Okay, great. I know we're kids and stuff, but... Stop it! Blue eyes. Blue eye was facing left, the last one, I think. Red eyes. They were facing... Me. Green eyes were facing... Oh, it can't be... It can't be me. Was it up? Yellow eyes, they were right. There we go, don't look. There we go. Oh, let's take the walkie. There's also a scrap of paper. Obtain a notebook scrap. Father went cold, he really did. I told mother, but she didn't believe me. She didn't believe anything I said anymore. Quite some time passed before my brother and sister noticed and she finally realized. She made a face I'd never seen before. A face I didn't want to see. There wasn't surprise or anger or smiling or laughter. After that day, Mother stopped saying anything. She was just silent, coldly staring somewhere. So the, the father really died. Man, this feels kind of strange. I feel really fuzzy, like I'm missing something. But I don't know what I'm missing. Alan, you have anything to, you're scared to lose? Not sure. Sorry. Sure is dark. 
but it's kind of relieving. Is darkness supposed to be this comforting? I don't... Wait! I, uh, don't really want you to go in. Or to go in myself. Are you gonna? Okay. I think we have to. Oh. Yeah, that's fucked. Huh? Quack! Quack! Good job getting here! Told you not to go, didn't I? Hey, Alice! Don't care about me, huh? You that curious about the doll hanging there? Huh? Doll? Sorry. Huh? Doll? No. That's Mum. That's my mum, isn't it? No. Wrong, wrong. Mum doesn't have those eyes. Oh. Well then, which eyes? <coughs> oh, shit. Tell me why don't you? Oh, God. This is fucked. What? Ah! Oh my! That's not mum. It's not. Because back then, what I said, what I said was, but mum, she... That's wrong. Yeah, this isn't right. Why are you looking at me like that? Why did I have to see this? Now, what's this about? What happened back then? And this result? It's all your fault, ain't it? Bitch around all you like, but you won't find any reason why you're not to blame. And trust me, going down, if I'd only hide root, is just a waste of time. Stop it! Stop. Ah, shish. If you say so. Smell ya. So his mom killed himself after the dad died. My big brother's good at soccer. My big sister's smart. But I'm nothing. I'm nothing, but I said I'm something. I have nothing, but I said I do. And I got so sad after I said it. Soon after, I didn't know what I had or what I was. No matter what I say, it might just hurt someone. But I did... The words toward the end are too blurred to read. And that's another door complete. Hope you enjoyed this very dark installment of Alice Mare. If you did, leave a like, a favourite, a comment. Let me know what you think of the story so far. Um, from what I understand, there's only a few parts left. It's quite a short game list. So um, I hope you're enjoying it. And uh, I'll see you in the next installment. Bye for now. Thanks. See you really soon. Bye for now.